In this snip, I'll show you how to add the Azure account extension into VS Code so you can access Cloud Shell. As a prerequisite, we need node.js v6 or later if you download and install. I have already done this. In Visual Studio Code, click on the Extension tab, go to the search area and type Azure Account. From here, we'll click on Install. Then we'll click on Reload. Now with the extension loaded, we can pick, pull up the command palette. If we type AZ, we'll get the commands that are within that extension. So we'll select Open PowerShell in Cloud Shell. So it's telling us we're not signed in, so sign in first. So we click on Sign In. To sign in, use a web browser to open the page. So HTTPS, Microsoft.com forward slash device login and enter the code. So we'll do copy and open. We paste in the code and we click on continue. This associates Visual Studio Code with your Cloud Shell account. And now you'll see we are requesting a Cloud Shell connecting terminal and now it's authenticating to Azure. And now we are in Cloud Shell. We can type a simple command CD and we can actually change directory into your account like so. We do DIR and you can see all resources, resource groups, storage accounts, virtual machines and web apps. To quit from the cloud shell, just type exit, pull up the command palette and then we can sign out. Thank you for watching this snip.